you stop, you trap, blind spot, but then you just piece of screen straight, you didn't mean who you had. So unfortunately it goes out. Critical mistake, so I'm sorry, you didn't pass your test today. I'm so sorry. Alright, so the situation here is we've got obstructed intersections and specifically these intersections are here you can see this stop line is way back on this road right here so if you actually stop behind the stop line you're not going to be able to see the traffic coming down this road and that's the problem that we're having with our driver whenever you get to an obstructed stop line like this you need to stop behind the line pull forward and then when it's clear you can make the turn but you've got to show them that you're checking to make sure it's clear and that's what our student did not do he got out onto the street and did not make sure it was clear he's got two intersections that he screwed up on and that was enough to give it a critical error so we'll go into the road test and cover those particular spots when they come up we're currently doing the pre-vehicle inspection now they're going to check all 17 of these items, although items 9 through 14, you're going to actually show them or demonstrate where these lo lo controls are located and demonstrate number 10, your arm signals. Be sure to pre-check your vehicle and make sure all these items are compliant. It would stink to have your vehicle fail the inspection before you even have a chance to do the road test yourself. I want to give a big thank you to R.A. for being willing to share his driving test video. It took some courage to share a fail video. Uh, we all want to pass our test the first time, but the truth is it doesn't always happen. I guarantee you by him sharing this video and by you watching this video, it's going to make an impression on you, and you're going to remember the lessons learned in this video when you take your own test. So a big thank you, R.A., for sharing this with us and the channel. If you would like to share your own video with the channel, we have a free dash camera program. You provide the video, we pay for your dash camera. It's very straightforward. If you want the details on that, check the links below the video. This is the number one way we get contributors to the channel, and we couldn't do the channel without your willingness to participate and contribute. As always, the comments section is the place for you to ask questions, to get encouragement. So tell us your test date. We'll wish you luck. If you have any questions, let us know. We'll do the best to answer. Okay, are you ready? Yes. Okay, at the white wall right there, left turn, please. Okay, uh, inside the parking lot, we're gonna make a left. Okay, we're gonna make a left turn right here. Make a right. Okay, going outside, we're gonna make a right turn. Okay, up ahead, a right turn. Alright, I need a lane change left. Okay, I 
went left. <coughs> I went left turn into this small street right here. This small street. Yeah. ahead a left turn left turn into this street right here left turn So up to this point, the driver's been doing okay a few right deductions, here, but this is an obstructed intersection. And according to the examiner, the student makes the initial stop and then just proceeds without even looking. And that would be a significant error. If there was a vehicle that was there, that would have been a critical error and a fail. So that was the first time the student did not show a second check on those obstructed intersections. Coming up here, we have the second intersection. Remember, stop within two feet of the stop line. If it's obstructed, you need to proceed slowly forward, scanning and looking, and stop again if necessary. This student is stopping short of the lines each time. That's dangerous. And then according to the examiner, not scanning. So right now, you're scanning left, right, and you're looking. If there were a vehicle there, that would have been a critical error. Okay, Andre, please pull over. Uh, pop your vehicle. Okay, I want you to please reverse back your vehicle straight until I say stop. Okay, you can stop. Alright. 
pull back onto the road, keep on driving. I hear a right turn. Right here, right turn, please. Okay, I need a lane change left. So there were also a few deductions on lane changes. You need to allow your turn signal time to work before you commit to that lane change. We typically say about three seconds. This student, I think with the nerves, the nervousness, would activate the turn signal and then almost immediately start to move into that other lane. Now they may have very well checked for traffic and checked their blind spot, but okay, you I'll need to give turn into this street right here. the signal some, you need to give the signal some time to work. So most of these errors were nerves. You're going to have nerves as well. So this student did a fair job. Unfortunately, the errors that were committed were significant. Obstructed intersections are very dangerous and second only to head-on collisions, side impact or T-bone collisions are some of the most deadly. We want to thank RA for sharing this test with us. I'm certain that in seeing this you're going right. to grow and recognize places that you can improve your own driving. So let's hear the examiner's comments as this test wraps up. Moving more forward. I'll tell you when to stop. Okay, that's better. Right. Your vehicle. Okay. All right. So stop sign right here. You stop. You look. But it's a blind spot. All right. There's a lot of trees here. You have to move up again to double check before you proceed. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, you stop, you check it, but then when you go straight, you don't check again, you just go straight. That's not good. You have to, especially in Pasadena, there's a lot of trees and bushes. If you stop behind, you, the way you uh, stop sign, you don't get 100% good view of it. You get like maybe 40%. So you have to creep up a little bit, check both ways, and then when there's no pressure, it's 100% safe, you proceed. You, by going straight, you're not sure if there's a car coming out. You can't take that chance. You did one time, I said, oh, okay. So that wasn't good, but I cannot, uh, I'll let it slide. But then, second time again, another stop sign, you do the same exact thing. You stop, you check, blind spot, but then you just go in straight, you didn't even move your head. So unfortunately, it goes out. Critical mistake, so I'm sorry, you didn't pass your test today. I'm so sorry. Uh, yeah. Um, so, blind spots, just... Yeah, pushes. You stop, yeah, sometimes, some stop sign, you see good view, like no problem. But mm -hmm. some stop sign, especially here, you see a like, trees and blocking, you don't get 100% feel. You stop behind it first, 
And then you don't think you got a good view? Just need to move up. Okay. Across the line, then. Stick your head out, check. Then, it's clear, then you proceed. Okay? okay? Especially on a test, we want to make sure that you know you're going in a safe thing. Yeah. Alright, um. So, that was your first time, so you have another, you have two more chances. Just go online, uh, make another appointment, and just try again, okay? okay. Yeah. Since you're over 18, there's no time limit, so whenever you feel like you're ready again, just make the appointment and just try again, okay? Okay, thank you. Yeah, for sure. Alright. Take care. Thank you.